Drop it. The Queen's pastry chef reveals her special mince pie recipe. The Queen's royal pastry chef has shared the recipe for the mince pie served at Buckingham Palace, however you may need to wait until next year to give them a try. Catherine Cuthbertson, a member of the team responsible for making over 1,200 mince pies for each of the Christmas receptions held at the palaces, said the secret to success is starting to prepare the mincemeat filling early at least a week, or even months in advance. Give yourself plenty of time, is the number one tip she offers in a post on the Royal Family's official website. Meanwhile she also recommends having cold hands when working with the pastry, which will help to keep it at the right consistency. Not content with creating just one type of mince pie, the royal pastry chefs create variations made with puff pastry, and another with flaked almonds brushed with egg whites and icing sugar on top. Add a royal approved snack to your Christmas menu with the full recipe for festive mince pies below. The recipe is also included in Royal Collection Trust's book, Royal Teas, Seasonal Recipes from Buckingham Palace. Ingredients Zest and some juice of one unwaxed lemon zest and some juice of one unwaxed orange 2 tablespoons brandy 1 tablespoon of port 1 tablespoon of rum 1 tablespoon of sherry 120 grams, 1 cup, suet 160 grams, 3 fourths cup, golden salt and is 100 grams, 1 half cup, raisins 100 grams, 1 half cup, mixed peel 100 grams, 1 half cup, currants 1 half teaspoon of ground nutmeg 1 half teaspoon of ground cinnamon 1. <music> 2 teaspoon ground cloves 160, 6 ounces, russet apples, peeled and grated 500 grams, 1 pound 2 ounces, sweet pastry egg washed for sticking lids on the bases granulated sugar for the top of the mince pies before baking icing sugar for dusting. Equipment. 12 whole non-stick shallow baking tray, mince pie tin 32 by 24 cm slash 12. 5 by 9 fluted or plain cutters. Method. Place all the dry ingredients into a large mixing bowl and stir. Then add all the liquid and grated apple and allow to soak for at least one week in a 1 kg kilner jar sat in the fridge or pantry. Preheat the oven to 190 degrees Celsius, 375 degrees Fahrenheit, gas mark 5, roll the sweet pastry into a sheet approximately 2 to 3 mm thick, place on a tray, and allow to rest in the fridge. Once rested, cut tops and bottoms for your mince pies using fluted or plain cutters, selecting sizes to fit your tin. Place the pie bases into the tin and prick them with a small knife or fork to prevent the pastry from rising during the baking. Spoon a teaspoon of the homemade mincemeat into the base and egg wash the edge of the pastry to enable the lids to stick. Place the mince pies in the fridge to rest for another 30 minutes, then add a pastry top to each, egg washing it and pricking a small hole in the top to allow the steam to escape. Sprinkle with granulated sugar. Place the baking tray on the middle shelf of the preheated oven and bake the pies for about 15 minutes, or until the pastry turns golden and the mince meat starts to boil slightly. Remove from the oven and allow to cool slightly before taking the pies out of their tin. Sprinkle the mince pies with icing sugar and serve immediately. To add a festive feel. The mince pie tops could be shaped with a star cutter or perhaps a holly shaped cutter. Mm -hmm.